I started drawing and painting since the, I was in grade three, and I started as a normal uh, student in the art classroom, but gradually all of the students and peers and my friends, they were inspired of the amazing paintings I used to do, and they used to tell me that I'm an artist and my work is different than others in the classroom of my friends. So when I was in grade nine and grade eight, I realized that uh, I'm an artist because I used to win so many competitions between private schools in Bahrain. And uh, there were so many competitions that used to be with private schools, both in Bahrain and in the GCC. And I used to always win the first place. Mm -hmm. And I also joined so much of exhibitions and uh, events for artists. And I used to get awards for the first place and word of encouragement from so many people, such as the prime minister, the principal, my parents, and uh, different people that encouraged me and motivated me to start a business and motivate me to continue as an artist and create exceptional, unique paintings and never stop because this is a talent from God and uh, you should always start doing new paintings and uh, ensure that the work of your paintings is as an exceptional lever and just customer satisfaction is very important at the end of the day. And I have never actually been to any art schools or institute. Seriously? Yeah, this is a talent that I have, God has given me so I've never actually studied art. Mm -hmm. I've always been drawing and painting since I was a kid. O even though I stopped doing art for five years when I was in London studying at university and my master's. But after the five years when I came back in Bahrain, I felt that my talent and my uh, specialisms and my techniques were improved significantly. So I don't think that stopping, having uh, stopped for five years affected me. I came back stronger and more powerful and I started doing uh, my art business and everything went very smooth and amazing and I'm very thankful with the whole journey I have been through.